What's up guys, it's Klein Ball Free and we're gonna do a tutorial on how to spin a ball on an object. So um, first, first of all, you gotta learn how to spin a ball. So go to a tutorial, my tutorial, uh, just search Kalani Ball Free on how to spin a basketball. Um, you need to master that because you really need a good strong spin and that will really help you to spin the ball and object. So, because without speed or control, it's gonna be difficult, okay? So, learn how to spin a basketball. All right, and then after that, um, uh, the key tips on spinning a basketball on an object, um, you have to keep in mind a, a few things. So, first of all, like when you spin a basketball on your finger, your finger's not strong, right? And so because your finger is not strong, um, it's a lot more difficult uh, to handle, um, to spin a basketball. So if your finger is strong enough, it will hold, it will hold the spin. So if the object is weak, it will start wiggling. So this pen, so we're going to use a, a pen as an example. So this pen is kind of strong, so it would hold pretty good okay but if it was something that was weak it'll probably just fall off so keep in mind of that the next thing is um, when selecting your object making sure there is a, a pointy area so like the pen is uh, have a has a pointy area or I would usually pick a corner so um, say it's a Say like this, it's a round object right here, but if I tilt it, I can hit a corner and have that, um, let's say, a triangle, <laughs> that little tip. So if I angle it, I can spin the ball on here. So if I angle it, I can spin the ball on there. But if I was going straight forward, it wouldn't be as good. But I'm very good at it, so that's why I can do it. So first step. Find something strong, that'll make it a lot easier. Second step, if, if it uh, doesn't have a tip, look for a tip, or if there is not a tip, then go aim, aiming for a corner, a corner, okay? So that way, it's, uh, it's a lot easier that way. Um, another tip, last tip, I think this is um, another important one. So on my tutorial on how to spin a basketball, I told you if your finger is not strong enough, put your thumb here and you, you'll be able to spin the basketball a lot better um, because now your thumb has the support. So to keep in mind, when spinning an object, if I hold the pen from the bottom, as you can see, it's not as strong and it's wiggling, okay? But if I have a closer, if I have a closer grip, it's stronger, okay? So that's also to keep in mind, is having a closer grip to make it more uh, sustainable. So, because if you have something that's, say if it's long and you hold from the bottom, it's just gonna wiggle. But if you hold from closer, it's more stable. So just an example again, if, it's, if you're holding from the bottom, of course it's gonna do that. If you hold closer, it's more stable, stronger, because you have give it more support. Um, so that was pretty much it. I mean, really, uh, you need to f find something strong. And if it's weak, I would suggest holding it as close as you can to make it stronger. And secondly, if, if it doesn't have a sharp tip or anything, I would suggest finding a corner and spinning the ball on that corner. So by tilting it, now you have a a little angle to spin the basketball on. So, um, and after that, you can be a little bit more creative, grabbing different objects. I can pretty much spin the basketball on almost anything. Um, so like, I got the remote, but I had to put it in an angle, because if I had it up, I, I can do it, but it's uh, very difficult. So if you wanna like, like in some of my videos, I would spin the basketball and I would, uh, uh, you know, I would do many different things. I could talk at the same time because 
uh, I know that basketball will spin really good on this angle. But if I had it here, I would probably would talk really fast because I know I would drop it, it would drop quickly. So, um, yeah. So if you have the angle, it will spin longer. If you don't, but you still can spin the basketball on the object, it won't last as long. So that's pretty much it. Um, and then once you get that down, um, I would suggest just starting off with a pen. Um, that's usually the typical thing. And I'll show you some variation right here. Boom, just spin the ball on the pen. Then you can pull out your arm and put it right here. Again, one more time. Spin the ball on the pen first. Pull out your arm and then bend your elbow like that. And then you'll be able to hold it. And you can also do it on someone else. Um, also another one would be spin the ball and then bend, bend your head. And bite on the pen. So that way, as you can see, remember I had having close grip, my teeth will have a really good grip on it. Um, caution, you might lose your teeth if, if you uh, don't know what you're doing. So uh, take it easy on that trip. I don't want you to lose a teeth because of me. It's all on you. <laughs> so uh, another one in just regular, a regular pen spin and you can pass it on to someone else. Um, so that's pretty much it. Uh, and then you can start spinning basketball on your, on other objects that you can find. Uh, and just have fun with it. And usually I just do that type of video, spin the ball, and ball is life. And I pretty much can do it on anything. So hopefully you found this uh, tutorial uh, very helpful. And if you uh, wanna learn more tricks, or uh, learn anything else. Um, Dan, that's pretty low, huh? <laughs> but uh, uh, yeah, make sure you guys subscribe to me uh, at Kalani Ball Free on this YouTube channel and comment down below what, what else you guys wanna learn and what you guys think about this tutorial, if it was helpful. Um, and comment also comment down below what else you guys wanna learn. It doesn't need to be bas about basketball, it could be about something else. And yeah. I like, uh, I could be teaching how to make peanut butter and jelly sandwich while I spin a basketball. So uh, anything, uh, it doesn't really matter. I just wanna have fun with it, teach you guys as best as I can, and uh, hopefully this helps you guys. All right, guys, I'm out. This is Klein Ball Free, and ball is life. Ah.